Hi, everybody. Welcome back. This is Monkey Dubs. Playing a brand new game on the channel. This is Pokey Rogue. This essentially is a Pokemon battle simulator in which you play a whole bunch of matches in a row to determine if you can be the ultimate Pokemon trainer, which as far as I'm concerned, I'm very likely to be. Now, you get to choose three Pokemon as starters, starters and Pokemon you catch along the way uh, in your battles and in your runs it get added to your starter collection. So... By default, you have access to every generation's top three starters. Uh, well, not a top three, just starters. And all the way to Gen... That's... that's This is Gen 7, Gen 8, Gen 9, looks like, yeah. So, all the way to Gen 9. And for the first one on the channel, I thought it would be appropriate to just, just rock the, the starting three. Bada bing, bada boom, Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle. And we just start the run from there. I think you scroll all the way down here. Begin with these Pokemon. Yes, let's do it. So my run before, I my first ever one, I did a a, a Chikorita team to see if I could get her to like force her to victory, and I actually made, made it a pretty long way. So let's jump right in here. A wild a wild Pidove spawns. This is where I have a difference from the last time. Last time I started with only Chikorita. This time. Let's go ahead and get... I, I think I want ball, um, Squirtle out here the most. I think he probably has the highest defense stat, which would make him an excellent candidate against this Pito. Now, please don't one-shot it. I would like some fodder. Thank you. Appreciate that. I know that if I, be, if I get to a certain level in this run... My Pokemon will all level up together, but for now, I'm going to go ahead and just throw a Pokeball at this Pidove. Pidove? Pidove? What's the name of this Pokemon? Someone let me know. Pidove was caught. Moveset, Gust, Growl. Its, it's IVs are actually not bad across the board, meaning its stats. As you can see here, its stats. Okay, let's roll. Everyone gets a little bit of XP. And we get a choice at a reward here. So I can... This is my shop as well. So in my top right corner, over here, you will see... You will see... Uh, this is how much money I have. So I can spend it on potions, ethers for PP, and revives, which are quite pricey. Uh, or I... And then this is... I can choose a reward. Uh, five Pokeballs, a lore, which doubles the chances of encounters being a double battle for five battles, which sounds kind of nice, actually. Um, and potions. For now, I think I am going to go for Pokeballs. And we roll. Might be a bit of a of a troll pick right there, because I could have definitely gone for a a double swap or a double battle here. But we just we're gonna I'm gonna lean into the fire water grass core here. So Bell Sprout is a grass type. We're gonna use our fire damage moves. One shot it. Get more XP for one shotting. Get an extra Pokemon to sack if you catch it. Do I want Great Balls, X-Speed, or Potion? Honestly, let's let's invest in our early game here and go with X-Speed. No need to swap. Absolutely not. You go Ember here. I think my strategy is going to be pretty simple. Bulbasaur gets the least XP because it's the tank. I think I'm going to want to have more levels on Charmander and Squirtle. If I have to choose, it's going to be Charmander and Squirtle with more levels. And Bulbasaur gets third amount. X accuracy, I don't see it being that important. Let's go ahead and stock up on some more potions then. We take, I think we take one shots in the early game here. Will you switch Pokemon? No, I will not. Ember me. The Caterpie goes down. Having Charmander in the early game is kind of kind of nice. When I played with only Chikorita, it was this. These were some tough battles. Let's see. 5x Pokeball, a Lumberry, or a Rare Candy. Let's see. Cures any non-volatile status condition and confusion. That could be really helpful in the right situation. Rare Candies, I don't think, are that important right now. And let's give... Let's let's uh, give Charmander... Let's give Charmander a way to, to get rid of status effects. Alright, yeah, Youngster Kenway's got my first trainer battle ready for me. All right, Puchiana. Don't see a reason to swap here. He's dark. I'm fire. We roll. You burned, homie. You want to use tackle? That's that's your prerogative. We go next. 
turn based combat. I go first and I have more damage. That means you lose, brother. Like, that's not fair. That's not how this should work. Well, did you check your speed stat? Because I, I brought X speed to this combat. You were not ready for that, were you, youngster Kenway? Yeah, you don't have any more Pokemon. Thanks for the 110 bucks, though. It was well played. You got a five damage off, and I took out both of your Pokemon. Can you... Can you just, don't show up next time. Invest in my future with a nugget. Five great balls. I think five great balls might do something for us. Bidoof, not a mean Pokemon, honestly. I don't want to over-level Charmander, but at the same time, I do kind of over want to want to over-level Charmander. Tackle is fine. I can I can afford potions. Well played. That should be a big chunk of XP. Yep. I think this might be a moment in time where we actually do take the potion. Let me apply to our Charmander. Let me roll. Do we really do we need a flying type? Do we need a flying type? I would say no. I don't think we do. Heck's gonna hurt here. Take five damage. But we can we can always afford potions. I don't want to buy potions yet. Smoke screen is not a bad move to learn. I think we go 5x great balls, invest in our future. Let's go Charmander. Rival battle. Rival Ivy. There you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Did you forget to say goodbye to your best friend? You're going after your dream, huh? Today really is today, isn't it? Well, listen, blah, 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 blue, blah, blah, sister. Throw out your first Pokemon. What did you bring? You brought a chestman to a Charmander party. That is... That's certainly a matchup for you, I will say. Tackle, what's going to do? Four points of damage? It did six points of damage. Gotta respect your grit and your grind and your hustle on that one. Six points of damage. Go ahead. Tallow? I don't sweat it. I don't sweat it. I think Tallow is going to do... Oh man, do I get uh, do I get healed up after rival battle? Uh, oh, Tallow uses focus energy. That's crazy. I don't have my XP anymore, so Tallow goes first. I think Tallow does a a, a bazooka of damage here. A Charmander will die if I let it, if I if I try to tank it. I go first anyway. That's what I'm talking about. That could have been pretty bad. If she got a she got a kill on Charmander and then started critting on me. Yeah, you lost fair and square, absolutely. Yeah, give me some items. Show me what you got. What am I working with? You received a super XP charm, thank you very much. And an XP all, thank you. What do we want? Um do you want Lepa Berry, an X accuracy, or a potion? At this point, it's just a potion for my dude Charmander. It's going to be carrying one strong Pokemon for now. This EXP all. I just want to get to the next, the fire move, and then maybe, maybe we swap. Okay. I got, I was poisoned, but my Lumberry should cleanse the poison. Yep. Very nice. And I'm not poisoned. Plus 24, plus 24. Getting rid of this P-Dove could actually be a, a, a move here, because I don't want the XP going to around to three different Pokemon. X-Attack would be useful if my Pokemon during attacks. Let's do 5x Great Balls, invest in the future. Chair Beam? It's a boss Pokemon. Okay. Wait, you, you summon... You summon Drought, which means my fire moves are going to be boosted. Congratulations, you do, I think, about seven points of damage. Your special defense rose. I understand that. That's actually, that's not good for us. 
But the sunlight is still strong. I still think I get to have... Oh, a heal tech. A heal tech Cherubi. That's certainly something. I mean, I have the perfect Pokemon for it. 100% to zero. Yeah, that's that sunlight plus super effective. Level 10 Charmander. Special attack up two is a good sign. Okay, Pedo, congratulations. You're level three. You're not sticking around. Stop getting that look in your eye. Come back, Charmander. Let's roll. Now, to be clear, I'm not really a Charmander guy. Uh, I've, always, I've always been grass types. Sorry, my, my mouse cursor's been in the way. I've not really been a Charmander guy. Level crap has increased to 16. But I'm, I mean, I mean, I think we gotta release. I think we gotta send Pedo to its shadowy death here. If you could get some chip damage, then I can maybe send out Squirtle. There we go. Get some, get some chip damage for me. Oh, what a super luck! What a super luck! What a super luck too. The Pokemon is so lucky the critical hit ratios of its moves are boosted. I I really don't think it's it's I don't think it's good enough to keep it around. Don't use Howl. Wait, is that a setup move? No, your attack rose. Okay, whatever, bro. Good job, good job, Pedo. You're doing a great job. And use Howl again. This it's actually worst case scenario because now Pedo is going to eat the XP. This bird, <laughs> this bird's like, keep me, keep me on the squad. Do you see? I've got amazing mo. I have an amazing ability. All right, bro. Fine, but you are fodder. You are nothing more. You're definitely not getting a nickname either. If you can, I'm not even sure if you can do nicknames in Pokey Rogue. Oh, an Ultra Ball. What is that? It's a PP up. Mm, as much as I want a PP up, I think an X defense. Give me an X defense. I feel good about an X defense here. Let's go to. I kind of want to get S Squirtle and Bulbasaur a little bit of training here. Let's go Water Gun right off rip here. Echoed Voices. That's not fair because I took defense. That's a critical hit. Ooh. 11 points of damage, but I only have 10 remain. I think we do swap to... Let's see if Bulbasaur... Let's see how much Bulbasaur can tank. If Bulbasaur can tank too, that'd be good here. Tackle, I have an X defense. That's good. We use Vine Whip. See how much damage that does. Not bad. You use Tackle. How many points of damage is that going to do? That's going to do several. Pedove, you're, gonna, you're getting sacrificed, I think, to get a little bit more XP on my main lads. And it is what it is. Unless, of course, you pull this one out of your hat. No, what you won't. I appreciate what you've done for me, but all you did was sack XP. And at the end of the day, I, I hate you for it. I think I think we must go Charmander, and that's the that's the that's the position that we find ourselves in. But it was to get a little bit of an XP boost on the other Pokemon. Uh, do I really want Devil Battles at this current moment? No, I think I'd rather take... I'd rather take a little bit of free potion. I'm one of my backups here. But Doof level 8 is a little bit scary. I think I will fight in just Ember here. We're going to be leaning a little bit hard on Charmander. Good burn. If he uses a, if he uses a physical attack, it's going to do nothing with my X defense plus burn. Nothing against me. Alright, we, we torch it. Things are a little bit hairy with the the level of my smaller Pokemon here. They should each be getting level soon. Yeah. Enigma Berry. What is that? Restore 25% HP if hit by a super effective move. That's not bad. Doubles the chance of encountering being a double battle for five battles. Let's see a choose your destination at a crossroads. I I have yet to use a, a map. I have I I want to see how it works. Even though I probably should have taken the. 
the defense one there. Obedient Pokemon, selfish Pokemon, Pokemon have unique characteristics. Got it. <clears throat> Let's see what yours got. Alakid, electric type damage. Charmander, fire type damage. We have we have a neutral position here. As long as he does not paralyze me, I think I will be okay here. His extra speed though is a little bit scary here. Charmander's blaze come into a, comes into effect there. When I end, when I hit red health bar, then I activate blaze. So that level up is actually a little bit of a of a nerf here in this fight. Gibble, dragon type. Dragon type. I think what we do is we go for a. Oh, we can't heal up. We go for an ember here. Oh, I do have blaze. Okay, that's fine. Gibble was burned. Very, very useful. That's a, that's a dead Charmander, unfortunately. It's super effective. Oh, but not a dead Charmander, though. I became trapped by a sand tomb, and I'm hurt by the sand tomb. Okay, fair, well played. This is our first real obstacle here. You're hurt by burn. That's good. That's good news. Let's go Bulbasaur out there, because he at least does neutral damage against the ground type. I guess so does Squirtle at that, at that point, but... I think we I think we can get away with the vine whip here. Phantom is neutral against me. Because it, it's super effective against poison, but not very effective against grass. Okay, you're gonna you're gonna withdraw Gibble. I, I respect that play. Venonat's a strong strong player here. Yeah, that's this is not this is not good. Squirrel has a bad matchup here as well. Definitely needed to catch more Pokemon, I think. Okay, good. I chose the right move. I hit Tackle. Is Gross just the better move here? I don't know. Supersonic, that's not good. Come on, Bulbasaur. Give me this. You're confused. I need you to not hit yourself in confusion. I like your style. Venom not using its tackles is not good. Is not good. Not good news. I'm due for a hit. Yeah. My vine whip is disabled no more, which is irrelevant. Bulbasaur snapped out of confusion. I used Tackle. It wasn't disabled. Okay, Tackle was disabled. Congratulations. If I can catch this guy on a Disable. Like, the, the, fact, that, the fact that he's not just using Tackle on me is, is, is an absolutely saving grace here. Overgrow's even ju juicing that damage a little bit. Good, another supersonic. That's perfect for me. You keep going with that. The odds are is that I kill myself, yeah. Okay, two Pokemon down. It's all up it's all up to my man Squirtle with 12 points of HP. And it's pray that we go first. Let's go. Tackle. Hmm. Oh, your attack missed. That's super amazing for us. Tackle here. Disable. That's a strong move right now. Tackle's disabled now. I should have I should have probably predicted that. Water gun is gonna be not very effective, but my torrent sh maybe should help me in this fight. The level up matters. The double level up matters. Rapid spin. Yes. So rapid spin. A spin attack that can almost that all Coastal Limited such move is Bind, Wrap, Leech, and Lead Seed. It also raises the user's, user's speed. I think I can... I think I can get rid of Tail Whip for that. I'm not sure. I don't think it'll be useful for this fight, but... Here we go. 1v1. Mmm. This is Water Gun. Don't use Confusion. Why do you know that move? 
I'm at 1 HP. I use Water Gun. Torrent doesn't do enough. That's it. GG. Hey, we know we know enough to know when we're toasted. We know enough to know when we're toasted. What was that? Round 14? That's 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 a brand new best for us. A brand new best. Let's run our, let's go right back to the well. Let's let's go. You know, I kinda wanna try to see if the Gen 2 starters are more goaded because I'm I'm more of a Gen 2 Andy. So maybe I, maybe I, I do just go to Gen 2, the Gen 2 lads, no? Yeah, I think, that, I think I might. Okay, so that's Chikorita, Cyndaquil, and Totodile. Let's rock that. I think that'll be fun. The Gen 2 starter lads. Chikorita being, of course, my favorite of all time. But I would say that I, mostly because I would say my bias from Chikorita began watching my older brother play um, Pokemon Silver. And I think he chose Totodile. And that meant that his rival had a pretty boss Chikorita. Let's have Chikorita take the hits here for a bit. And a pretty boss Bayleaf. And that, so I kind of liked Bayleaf the best. So I thought it was pretty sick. The fact that it used, like, light screen and stuff, like, pretty, pretty cool tech. Now, do I ex do I think it's that great of a Pokemon? No. I do like if it's, its ability to be, like, a cleric. But, other than that, not really. I think we maybe want to go... Maybe X special attack for the beginning here. Alright, I want to switch Pokemon. Yes, I want to keep everyone balanced across the board this time. I don't think I want to juice up one. I think I need to keep everybody balanced. Ooh, I don't even have a fire move. That is a huge problem. Gen 2, what are you doing to me? Gen 2, you're, you're, you're cursing me. You don't want me to succeed. There we go. We're through. Let's see, rare candy, five great balls, or a salak berry. The salak berry would be, would have been so handy last time. Let's do a rare candy. Do I have to use it right now? We'll juice up Toto Dial. Toto Dial learned water gun. I will not switch Pokemon. I will use Cyndaquil against this Wooloo. Cyndaquil, if you don't beat this Wooloo, we're going to have some serious problems, brother. Okay, we're going to have to switch off of Cyndaquil. We're going to go back to Chikorita. This Wooloo is a tanky lad. Wouldn't mind actually catching this, this bad boy. My attack fell. That's, that's pretty bad news as well. I really don't have a way to get this bad, bad boy down a little bit lower health. I think that's going to be lo as low health as I'm going to be comfortable with right there. Still Pokeball at it. Stay in there. Thank you. Chikorita gained 37 XP, EXP points. I couldn't have asked for anything greater. Thank you very much. Okay. The Salic Barrier is nice, but at this point, I think my Pokemon are kind of bleeding. We're kind of we're kind of bleeding. I think I, I do need to use the potion. I'd like to switch my Pokemon. Yes. My Cyndaquil. Let's go. Use tackle. You use scratch. I use tackle. Let me guess. You're gonna use scratch. Well, then you should have been faster before you chose the strategy. Try to warn him. It's like, you got to swap. It's not fair. Well, they're, they were the one that attacked me. I think. Agility is a nice setup move to have. 
I said I don't know if we get a chance to use it. I mean, I get not ables across the board, too. At least I get to go back. Let's let's do a standard potion on Chikorita for 42. A standard potion on Cyndaquil for 42. And let's take let's take five great balls. You've got nine hundred and sixteen dollars. There's no reason not to spend it. All right, last flow. Let's do it. You bring a Caterpie to a Cyndaquil party once again. I own you. Problem that I am having is that I don't have a fire move quite yet. So we just gotta bash tackles. Which is fine with me. I just really wish I had made use of my X special attack that I think I picked up first round. Assuming that I would have Ember at this point. Tackle's gonna hurt. It's gonna do five points of damage. But my tackles are hurting them a lot more. The fact that my Cyndaquil is slower than a level four Poochiana is quite worrying. Ooh, nice try. Yeah, I know. Well, you, get, you got your little Caterpie. The fact that my Cyndaquil is slower... Oh, wait. That, never mind. I've been String Shot. That's right. I'm going to be slower than everyone. Snorlax could be out here. I'd be... I'd be whipping. By the way, if Snorlax shows up, I'm going for the catch 100%. My speed harshly fell. Harshly fell. Well, I'm already going second Cyndaquil or Caterpie, so you're waste. Last flow, you need to work on your... Yeah, it was for the girl with the name like flow. You need to work on your strategy and tactics. I'm already too slow. I'm never gonna go first. You're wasting your string shots. And you're killing your Pokemon. There's no reason to go PP Max here. I don't think so anyway. Take five Pokeballs. Now a Talo a Talo could be something that we might be interested in. I'm concerned about our lo level overalls. I should not have kept this Pokemon out, but I need him to get a move that is fire. With my attack falling, I'm not sure how I like the odds of winning this battle. Pecs are going to do how many points of damage? That was six points of damage. I've got seven health. Let's let's bank on a low roll here. Bada bing, bada boom. He's got nerves of steel. Nerves of steel. All right. What did you? What do you got for me? Ice Beam. Can anyone learn Ice Beam? Toto Dial. That that seems like an excellent move to teach you. Why did I not use a potion? I'm sitting out here with. Yes, I will most I will most certainly want to be switching, and I will go. Hot take here. I will go. Chikorita. I need all three of my Pokemon to stay up a high enough level to be involved. I'm not sure if that's the real way to win, but that's the, that feels like the real way to win actual Pokemon is having an assortment of Pokemon that can do different things. But prob probably juicing one is the ultimate strategy. Let's go to Toto Dial. These tackles from this Pat Rat are really hurting me. I think we just drop an Ice Beam on his forehead. Or is it Water Gun? Water Gun's going to do 80 damage. Ice Beam is going to do 90. Well played, Toto Dial. Chikorita gaining to level 6 is a big move. And she gets Rage Relief. Thank you. Everyone but uh, Cynical doing their part. Alright, so we definitely want a potion up here. Everybody... Everyone get a little bit juiced up. For 48 bucks, it's a steal. Um, I think I will take one more potion on Toto Dial. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna play a Greedy. I'm gonna take things to help us now. X Special Defense. If this rival battle has anything to do with special attack, I will be happy to have an X special defense. Let's go. All right. Once you once I beat you, I think I always get an EXP ch charm. Let's see. Quaxley, a water type. Okay. Let's go ahead and swap to our Chikorita immediately. Is Quaxley a flying type off the bat? Is the question I have. Hound does a, a good chunk. She withdraws Quaxley, and she goes to Pick a Peck. That's your prerogative. That's your prerogative. You're still going to take a, a fairly good bit of damage here. Now, I have I have a, a secret that I have a an Ice-type move. So you're not going to be expecting a an Ice-type move to one-shot you as you use your second Peck, and, hope that, and I hope that it doesn't crit, which it doesn't, and then we go. 
get wrecked. So, you didn't know I had an ice beam in my pocket, but that's just what we brought to the table. All right, now we got Quaxley. I don't want Total Dial to die, but I think my Pokemon get full healed. This could be a time to sack Wooloo. Pound comes in. I might even tank it. I don't tank it. Those Pounds look like they're hurting. But hopefully my Chikorita can do something here with Razor Leaf. Wow. Wow. That is quite the, that's quite the technique. Razor Leaf's got to land. It does. Bingo. One more. One more. Pound shouldn't one-shot me. Razor Leaf lands. GG. We're through the rival. Chikorita Grain goes to level 7. We like that. Total Dial also grows to level 7. We have got a well-diverse team with, with levels across the board. A little bit different strategy than our first, first run. Big ups to the uh, developers of Poke Rogue. It's amazing. I'm actually playing on controller. You can play this game on your browser. Type in Poke Rogue. Make an online account to register. And then start collecting your Pokemon. Once you catch a Pokemon, you add it to your starting collection. I think we, we, we would be kidding ourselves if we didn't at least want a dire hit. We get a double battle anyway. I have I, I do not have this Cascoon thought. Uh, I will switch Chikorita, yes, to nobody. And I will not switch to Cyndaquil. I want to we want to go attack the the Wurmple because we want to catch the Cascoon. I still do not have a fire move, which is getting a little bit ridiculous at this point. Poison Sting comes in the Chikorita. That is super effective. I don't get po I do get poisoned. I gotta get Chikorita out of there. But oh, okay, they 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 go double on Chikorita. Good night. Don't worry, we'll be fine here. All right. The fact that the fact that I don't have I mean Ice Beam would have been like a, a nice move to have last turn. Let's not mess around here. Let's Ice Beam you and tackle you. Down goes Wormpole. Cyndaquil goes to level 8, and he doesn't get a fire move yet. I'm not worried about it, because I'm never going to need it. This might be a buy revive situation for Chikorita. So what about Grudel level 8? Cyndaquil, you got to be close, friend. you got to be close. X attack makes a lot of sense right now. Ooh, this... I will switch Pokemon. So this, this Zigzagoon boss is gonna hurt. Yeah, and it's gonna have stab tackles. Yep. I'm gonna... I'm gonna chunk it because of X attack. A uh, speed rises. It goes with sand attack. That's That's a huge get for us. Hit this tackle, and everything is and everything is square. Get that crit. Oh, don't get the crit. Now you use tackle, you kill. No, you don't kill, and I hit the tackle. Let's go. What a wild ride. Let's go. Level 9 Cyndaquil. We're holding on by a thread. Give me that EXP charm. And a full heal for the squad. Nice. We like that. A Mankey. Okay. You know what? I, I might be in the market for a Mankey. Would you mind joining the squad? Mm. I will switch Pokemon because I need to keep the Chikorita level high. Use Razor Leaf. I, I just don't know if I got room for the Mankey though. But do I? Should I? It's already level 7. It's a fighting type. It can get through normal types. I credit and it's killed. So it doesn't really matter, does it? You take those EXP points, Chikorita. You deserve them. Taking hits for the whole team. It's been years. The disrespect. Uh, big Nugget, Pokeball, or X Accuracy. 
I think it's like the matter amount of money. That's gonna be worth a few potions. Meowth, of course, I would like to have you on the team, but for now, you're gonna really fake out. Fake out does 10 damage to me. 10 damage. Does it always do 10 damage? That's broken early game. Alright, that's fine. 9 points and poison powder. Sick. Wulu, you're... You're... You're soaking XP right now. Okay, let's see. A super potion... I think I want to go regular potion on Chikorita. And go lore here. Go lore, no double battle. Unlucky. I will switch Pokemon. I want to go for Toto Dial. Keep, keep mixing it up. I think Ice Beam makes sense here. It's going to do more damage. I actually lose this battle to this Baneri in a 1v1 if it actually plays the smart moves, which it's not. But we get a freeze, which is absolutely enormous. Should I should I consider capturing this Baneri? I think I should. Do not crit this. Okay, if there's ever a time to throw a ball, it's when a Pokemon is frozen. Okay, we got the level 9 Pokemon. And we add it to our collection of starters. Total Dial ends up getting quite a few points here. Should an old move be forgotten and replaced with Bite? Yes. Which move should be forgotten? Let's say Leer. There we go. Total Dial learned Bite. Let's roll. Wulu grew to level 5. Okay, you're... You're almost about half as useful as any of the wild Pokemon. I want you to always remember that. One egg voucher. These are rare. I want the egg vouchers, I think. That's how you do the gacha game mechanics at the arcade. Will I switch Pokemon? Yes, I will switch Pokemon. Cyndaquil, you need to start pulling your weight here and get yourself a fire move. I see the best way to do that is to put you in battle. Against this Puchiana, see what you can do. I think I still have my X attack. Yeah, for one more battle. Let's make it let's make it useful here. Send a kill, get the goal for the kill. Level 10. Do I learn a fire damage move? I do. Okay, we do got one. Toda, level 10. Welcome to the business. Baniri, how about you take a level as well, but you remain frozen? Dragon Dance? Who can learn this? Total Dial can learn Dragon Dance. Dragon Dance... It's attack and speed stat. I think we're fools. I think we're fools if we don't take this move. Dragon Dance, attack and speed. All I need to do now is get my total dial in there, use Dragon Dance, and then bite everything. There we go. There's one Dragon Dance. We take a hit. That's okay. We're going to use Bite. How much damage will this do? There you go. And a Bidu flinched. And I will always go first. Not bad. Did we get a potion this round, though? I'm, I'm looking to spend some cash for some potions. Wulu? Okay. You might actually be useful one day. Thank you. A little potion round. Lance Bear. Raises critical hit ratio of Pokemon is below 25 HP. Could be useful. Okay. Let's go ahead and potion up the squad. I don't think Baneri will be useful. How many Pokeballs do I have? I got eight in inventory. You know what? Let's give this Totodile a Lance at Barry. Okay, I don't have either of these Pokemon captured for the squad or for the for long term. 
Uh, I won't switch to Karita, but what I, will, what I will do is Dragon Dance, and then I will Razor Leaf. Does Razor Leaf hit my own Totodile? Wing attack on my on my Chikorita makes a lot of sense. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna tell you sit here and say that it doesn't make sense. Okay, it's not very effective against the Yang. Oh, oh, but he used payback. Oh, okay. So Chikorita actually lives here. So this bite should do a decent amount. I think we should honestly just go for Ice Beam. And for for this for this Pokemon, we swap out to Baneri. There you go. Just like that. And we pray that this, this guy targets this uh, Baneri. And doesn't kill it. But you didn't get hit. You never got hit. Oh. Stakeout. What does Stakeout do? I'm not sure. Alright. Let's toss, uh, let's toss Cyndaquil out there. And we're gonna throw a ball. You kill my fodder, you become fodder yourself. Let's go. It's plus attack minus defense in its nature. Okay. Let's see, a nugget. I think I think we're kind of due for a potion, right? I think we could. Let's not take the potion yet. Let's make sure that we go to the shop first and apply potions via our, our cash supply. Make sure everybody's topped off. 680 per revive is a little pricey. A little bit pricey for me. Let's actually go for five Pokeballs this time. A wild sparrow appeared. Okay, let's roll. Will I switch Pokemon? No, I don't think I will. I think that I think we'll just use Ice Beam and hope that it wins the day for us. You lash out a fury of attacks. Which I can respect, honestly. So I respect it so much that I'll even be willing to add you to the squad. How do you feel about that? A chance to be in the squad. I think you feel pretty good about it. Your minus attack nature makes me not like you, but you're getting here for Baneri. Baneri, thank you for what you did, but you're gone. We had to cut ties at some point. Wulu, your days are, are also numbered. So we've been taking out a lot of low health Pokemon, but that is okay. More potions required? I think so. It's it's a small price to pay to for peace of mind. Let's just get everybody topped off. You say, why are you spending 70, 70 gold on that small thing? You might think it's small, but I think it is not small. We're going to teach Light Screen to Chikorita, which absolutely will have amazing things for us in the future. Chikorita forgot Growl, and Chikorita learned Light Screen. Let's go. Pedov, my friend. Unfortunately, I brought a move this time around that's that's strong enough to hurt you. But what will it be now, friend? Leer. Don't think that'll be it. I don't think that'll be good enough. How many Ice Beams do I have left? I've still got four Ice Beams left. So let's just toss a ball. I need to take a sip of water with the amount of yapping I do. The yapping I do on the daily. That's a good nature on that pedo. Might want to substitute this bad Larry in. Who goes loud? I'm sorry to say it, but woo -loo -loo. I'll see you later. I respect what you did for me. All right, Cyndaquil, Chikorita, you guys are... Everyone's doing a good job. Spread the love. Max Elixir. Restores all PP for one of... Oh, hmm. I'll do an Ether on your Ice Beam. But other than that, I'm not doing it. Take a Potion. Let's heal up Pidove. This time, I'm not going to get cut off guard. Everyone will be topped. And we'll take some Pokeballs. How about that? Alright, Pidgey. 
I can't keep replacing my Pokemon, but what is like, but what if I could? The problem here is that all my XP is going to the Pokemon with Ice Beam because all I'm going against is flying types. But what do you want me to do about it, brother? What do you want me to do about it? Got Pidgey. Let's go. I think that might be one of the first Pidgeys I've seen. Do I want to make room for Pidgey? I think I'm, I most certainly would. Now I'm going to have three birds. But I have a rule. L lowest level out, largest level in. Totodile wants to learn Scary Face. I don't think Totodile wants it to, to learn Scary Face. I think Totodile wants to keep the moves that it's got. Tell me I'm wrong. Let's see, a memory mushroom. Recall one Pokemon's forgotten move? I mean, we owe it to try. Forgotten move. So this would be really good late game. What does Scareface do? No. Um, Air Cutter? I don't think I really want to be teaching any of these Pokemon that. I think I'd take a potion on Toto. Take Pokeballs. Alright, what do we got? Let's go. Plains level 20. You remind me of an old friend. That makes me excited about this Pokemon battle. Alright. I'm excited too, friend. Let's go. Minchino. Against my Toto Dial. Alright, let's let's fight. Let's dragon dance. Echo Voice, the, the the move that killed me last round, this time it's doing 12 points of damage. I get a Dragon Dance off. I think I'm going to go for one more Dragon Dance. Does Echo Voice do more damage each time? Looks like it did. Alright, well, this is where it all comes down to. I got double boosted. And I have, and I have crit damage ratios. Should be high chance to crit here, or end. I have a chance to flinch, so it should be pretty hard to get through this total dot right now. Levels matter. Chikrita goes level 11. Now, it'd be way more optimal if I got something like Waterfall as a, as a physical water type move. But it, it is what it is here. Bite, high chance to crit, no crit. Uses Retaliate. That sounds like a move that's going to kill me. Yeah. Total Dial faints. Who do I who do I think is going to do more here? I think Cyndaquil does more. Let's go Lee. Uh, I wanted to use Leer instead of Ember. I saw the E and the R, and I think that might be the most troll maneuver of my entire time. But Retaliate does nothing. Retaliate does a lot. Retaliate does a, a, a ton. Ooh, I didn't get the kill. If I had not thrown my Leer attack, we would have been fine there. Okay, we go to Chikorita. We go to Pidgey. Hopefully Pidgey outspeeds here. Let's go for a quick attack. Whack. Hey, gotcha. Level 14, let's go. Everybody get your boosts. Everybody get your boosts. Oh, I defeated a gym leader. Let's go. Super XP charm. We rock. And a full heal for the squad. Welcome back, everybody. Go to Metropolis. What is that thing? A Yamper. Okay, let's rock. Do I want to switch my Pokemon? I think I would like to switch my Pokemon. This sounds like a good job for Chikorita, but it also sounds like a great Pokemon to catch. So let's first put up a light screen. And see what kind of shock to move this guy's using. Nuzzle. I think that might be physical. But it's not very effective on me. But it does guarantee it paralyzes. I'm not sure if it guarantees it. But I'm pretty sure it's a very high chance to. I'm okay with I'm okay with going into a battle with this guy. Just straight up like this. I seem to get him low enough. I just need to get him low enough. So that I can catch him. I think that's going to be good enough. Let's throw a ball. Stay in the ball, Yamper. One. 
okay. You have to eat a hit here. Oh, and it was fetch. That's crazy. Let's, let's try to save our Trickerita at the same time as catching this Yamper with the Great Ball. We accomplished to get two birds with one stone. Nice. Its special attack is only one. Yes, yeah, so I definitely want to. I definitely want to get Yamper in here. We'll get rid of Spiro. We'll keep Pedov. We'll play the Chikorita, I would say. Synthesis, yes. Let's get Synthesis on here. ASAP. Synthesis for... Tackle. Now Chikorita can heal in battle. Alright, Pito grew to level 12. Pito wants to learn the move Taunt. I... I honestly... Couldn't tell you no to that, brother. Get rid of Leer. If I need Taunt for some reason, which, which I don't think I will, I'll be happy to have it. Okay, let's definitely get some potions up on our side. A full heal is, removes one status ammo. It's 400, though. I think I can maybe not. Don't want to be greedy. Let's remove a status ailment. Take our Pokeballs and go. Okay, trainer battle. Let's do it. Clerk Michelle. That's fairy and steel. Okay, that, that would mean that my fire type would go pretty crazy here. Let's switch to my fire type. Hopefully I don't take too much damage. I would also like to get the extra... Extra... XP for my Cyndaquil as well. This should be four times effective. It wasn't. I have to swap off of this Pokemon now or else it just dies. Who's gonna take, take a tackle? I think Chikorita can. Oh, well, you said you withdrew Klefki. You bring in Meowth, which, which kind of works out for me, honestly. Because now I can. I would say let's poison powder you. Echo voice will hurt. But I can I can synthesis that. Oh, I really needed that poison powder to hit. I need to synthesis this turn. Okay. We heal back up to full. Echo to voice, I think, does more damage each turn it's used. So, I might be in trouble here. Yeah, there goes Chikorita down. We could maybe go... Toto Dial? We might be meeting meeting our, our grim fate here. Sure, let's Dragon Dance. Let's just get as greedy as humanly possible here. Nope, it's a critical hit. This is a wipe. This echoed voice Meowth. Dude saw an opportunity and just sent it. Just get a quick attack off. Maybe it won't have... Oh, man, this move is ridiculous. It's like a set it move on its own and only has one, like, one bad turn. And even that one bad turn wasn't that bad. This, I mean, this, if there's a way to go out, is to this extremely mouthy Meowth. It just... That just screams at me. Oh, you want, you want to switch now. What is going on here? That, is this, is that BM? Did they have BM programmed in? Dude was rinsing me. Now he goes Clefty. Give me a chance. Use Gust here. I still send a in the back. Do I have a way to s slow this person down? Don't think so. Cyndaquil was supposed to be my answer for this, because I thought Fairy takes 2x damage from fire moves. And I know Steel does. So 4x damage Leer should go crazy. 
but it didn't even do half this is uh, half his health. Well, you live and you learn. Take an L in that one right there. That's a pretty that's a pretty cool fadeaway screen. Anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button, subscribe to see more videos like this one. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.